Hi, crypto fans. This is Jason from SA Crypto. And today, we are going to be discussing Concordium Blockchain, the world's most advanced, privacy centric, public, and permissionless blockchain. Remember to hit that subscribe notification button to get notified when we cover our next Whale to the Moon coin. Let's get into it. With the rising interest in both digital currencies and central bank digital currencies, platforms like Concordium provide a high-speed, scalable, and secure blockchain that can be trusted. A major shift in banking infrastructure could be the reason that banks need to start using enterprise solutions such as Concordium. Although blockchain is on the rise, Corporate adoption of distributed ledger technology, or DLT, has been slow because the systems are not compliant with regulatory requirements due to them being anonymous. Given this fresh approach to blockchain technology that conforms to more rule-based global business demands, especially in regulatory compliance, Concordium aims to achieve widespread corporate endorsement within its network while being fully regulated. Concordium is the first non-permission-based public blockchain that international businesses can trust and is designed to be compliant with enterprise regulatory frameworks. Having close relationships with international companies like Volvo, IKEA and Saxo Bank adds to the credibility of Concordium and gives it a competitive advantage in the market. Concordium recently launched its fourth testnet and a Maninet release is due in 2021. This ZUG-based platform utilizes zero-knowledge proofs to preserve user privacy while also offering the ability to revoke anonymity, which keeps regulatories happy while protecting the identities and privacy of law-abiding citizens. The platform utilizes smart contracts with use cases in multiple sectors and industries, from IoT to supply chains. What is GTU? GTU is a global transaction unit that is designed by leading macroeconomists and currency protocol savvy experts. With its core objective being to create a self-sustaining payment model aiming to provide enterprises with a fully compliant private payment token. Lars Christensen is the founder of the Swiss non-profit Concordium Foundation and has more than 30 years of experience across the banking and financial sector. He is a global pioneer in forex and derivatives trading and co-founded Saxo Bank in 1992 which is a regulated, bank-licensed online trading and investment platform. Some interesting features of Concordium include regulatory compliance by design, privacy and verification of the user's identity, fast transaction and high throughput for global scale. It is future-proof via sophisticated interoperability, while using white-label production architecture and sharding with easy-to-deploy smart contracts. Concordium delivers a rule-based system that appeals to international enterprises, safeguarding their interests through increased transparency, improved governance, and guaranteed privacy. Concordium offers low and stable transaction fees in euro terms, using a stabilized transaction price mechanism Newer users are onboarded through a built-in user identification methodology at the protocol level, ensuring that an individual's identity is confirmed, kept private, and verifiable in transactions. Users of Concordium can trust the identity of the people using the network, and they can trust that their business case will hold through fixed transaction fees. 
as the race for a standard cryptocurrency enterprise platform heats up, Concordium is one company to watch as we believe it has all the makings of a trustworthy and technologically superior solution. If you are interested and would like to learn more or get involved in the project, be sure to follow the links in the description. And that is our overview of Concordium Blockchain, the world's most advanced, privacy-centric, public and permissionless blockchain. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Remember to leave us a comment. Do you want us to research a project or coin? If so, leave the coin or the project in the name of the comment section and we might cover it in our next few videos. Thanks for watching, and as always, good luck with your investments.